Yo, what's going on guys? Nashra here, back with another NHL 19 video, and today we're doing some tests. Since the start of NHL 19, the number one complaint that I have seen about Hockey Ultimate Team is the current state of the goalies. People are saying that goalies are making way too many desperation saves, cross crease saves, mid slot wrister saves, and today I'm gonna finally figure out if goalies make a difference in HUT. Now the biggest issue isn't necessarily that the goalies are making those saves, but it's the ratings with them. I've seen 80 overall goalies that make three to four desperation saves a game while my 87 Perrant struggles in net. To put this to the test, we're going to try two extremely different goalies. One, 87 Perrant, one of the highest rated goalies in the game. And for the second game, we're going to have Tyler Johnson, a 61 overall bronze player. Should not be very good. For today's episode, I'm just going to play one game with each of these goalies and count up the high quality saves that they make and the bad goals that they let in to see how they compare. Obviously, there's a lot more goalies in the game, so if you guys want me to test this out in future videos, we could try some silver goalies, we could try 80 overalls versus 84s, and just see what the difference is in all these goalies. But for today, we're gonna keep it simple, keep it to two, let's see how it goes. Also, before we get into this thing, I wanted to let you guys know, I'm gonna be doing an NHL 19 24 hour stream live on Twitch, twitch.tv slash Nasher. We just surpassed a thousand subscribers on there. You guys have been asking for a 24 hour stream for a very long time. So we are finally bringing it Friday the 28th at 5 p.m. Eastern. We are gonna go live 24 hours straight. Make sure you tune in. We'd love to see you there. All right, enough talking. Let's get into our first test with the 87 overall Perrant. This is also the squad that we're rocking. We got a really, really good hockey ultimate team. If you guys saw my dream team video, we made a couple upgrades even since then. So hopefully we play well. Here we are hopping into our first game. I have Perrant in net and I've got myself a little checklist. I'm going to be keeping track of the nice quality saves that he makes and the bad goals that he lets in. We'll see which outweighs which and we'll also see which Tendi he has in there. Now, obviously I'm like somewhat excited to make this a video because this is something I've been curious about myself. I've seen a lot of chatter in the community, especially about the overalls of the goalies and kind of what their performance has been like. Does height and weight matter? Like Perron's a little smaller. Personally, I feel like overall should be all that really matters, but it doesn't seem like that's the case. So hopefully we can find out some information today. I feel like we're gonna have to do this again at some point. But we'll see what happens. Here we go. Solani. Nice shot. Rebound. Crosby, how do you miss that? That's one of the like, biggest downsides of sports games. There's always going to be that little aspect of RNG or the luck on how the goalies play. Right, I know it's still early in this game, but generally I kind of get the vibe for how the game is going. Like five minutes in. And I'm feeling like we can definitely win this game. The other unfortunate thing is he has not taken a shot yet, which is... Kind of messing up our test here. Take a shot, man. Oh, let's go. Stop, let's. Ah, I'm trying to get that cheese, man. Ragging the puck. Okay, this is not good. Could it be Perrant with his first high quality save? And that is his first save of the day. That is actually a really, really good save. We will certainly count that one for the good save category. Oh, and we go right back. LeFleur, the one-hander on that right side. That was disgusting. The huge save for Perrant on our end leads to a rush up the ice, and LeFleur is able to bury the one-handed beauty. How do you do? Oh my, give me another top left. Woo! Our sample size is incredibly low, but I gotta say, Perrant right now is playing his game and keeping us in this. Oh, what a move. Back door. Ooh, okay. All right, he's coming. Yo, who doesn't even have a net? I probably should be paying attention to that, too. To Ovi. That is another big save. Yo, hopefully he has a decent goal in net. If not, this test could get interesting. All right, he's got Hellebuck in net, and I've got seven shots. And honestly, I feel like all seven shots have been, like, somewhat quality. Here we go. This is looking good, boys. Oh, that's a bad trip by me. All right, we'll see how Perrant plays on the PK. I think that's our first penalty of the day. Oh, you know what? That was off a of deflection. I might need to give, give Perrant a nice save on the little check mark there. Uh oh, this could be a goal. Okay, that one, that one for sure is counting as a nice save. All right, Perrant, and we're drawing penalty. Yo, Perrant is actually the game changer right now. There you go, I love 
love some four on four hockey. Give me that backdoor feed. Kutrov. That was actually beautiful, man. He snuck past all the defenders on that left side, found the open one T, and I think that snuck five hole. Oh, give me a breakaway. LT. See ya. One hand. Oh my. That was actually filthy. Kucherov with the LT spinorama action to the one-hander on the far side. Are you kidding me? So far, things are looking up here, boys. Give me another. Oh my, that's a good save. Wait, I'm gonna score one more goal and then we'll uh, we'll start doing some testing of our own. We'll let him have some shots from some high-quality areas just to see how prop performs. Oh my goodness, McKinnon hit the net. There's a good shot. All right, Pratt. Pratt with a nice little rebound save. I, maybe we count that as a nice. Ooh, okay. It's not over yet, man. This guy could easily come back. That's a nice little one T. I don't think any goalie's really gonna make that save. Ooh, seven seconds. One last rush with Obi. Top left. Dude, why is everyone missing the net right now? I've had so many chances. Hellebuck's playing well. I'm missing the net. We've got a 3-1 game going into period three. Uh oh, this could be it. Oh my gosh, no. My LBs are failing right now, boys. I'm trying to cut off those cross creases with the LBs. And they're somehow finding a way. I need to save for Piran on that one, though, to be fair. That one we're counting as a bad goal because I'm pretty sure that shot went right at the middle of the net and still went in. Please don't make me upload this absolute choke to YouTube. <laughs> Let's go, boys. We're not choking this. We're not choking. Oh, my. Ever since we got this 3-2 back, he's been playing a different game to be a... Oh, my gosh. What a play. <laughs> that was actually filthy. Nice goal, man. I'll give you that one. We've scored so many nice goals this game. Like, we're due for just, like, a greasy rebound on Hellebuck, I think. All right. Yeah. Goalies don't matter. Yeah, that's, that's unreal. Uh, I'm pretty sure he scored on four straight shots. And I I don't think I'm exaggerating. I'm pretty sure that's four straight for him. We got 822 left and now we're down. This is unbelievable. That one's gotta be that one's gotta be a save. I think Perot might have went for like a little like a little poke check. Ooh, two on one. Come with me with Fleur. Force it. That's a big cross crease save. Perot's not making that save. Okay, hey, last rush up the ice, boys. He missed a hit. This could lead to a good opportunity. Back door! Hold on, one more. We're good, we're good, we're chilly. We're chilly, we're chilly, we're chilly. Back door. GG, man. Wow. We actually choked it. 87 Perot. I think he scored four shots in a row. That one really, really hurts. I mean, we're talking goalie test here. Hellebuck had some really good save. Perot, not so much. 87 overall. Really struggled for us. Let's take a look at the shot totals. Total shots, we got 20 of them. I mean, you guys saw a lot of them were like decent opportunities, cross creases, pretty decent chances. He had uh, 12 shots, four goals, and that's 87 Perrant. Absolute trash, man. This one stings, that really stings. Please don't make me upload this absolute choke to YouTube. Game number two, Perrant. You're getting pulled, man. You had a rough game last game. That save percentage isn't quite where we want it to be. 87 overall Perrant's going on the bench. We got Tyler Johnson, 61 overall bronze card, stepping in. Let's see how this goes. All right, game number two, bronze goalie in net. I'm kind of curious, is this going to affect how I play defense? Like maybe the mentality of I know I can't let him shoot is going to make me play better defense. Is going to lead to a better save percentage. I... There's too many variables, man. I have no idea. Also, I think it's safe to say that this guy's going to be pretty confused as to why I have one of the better teams in the game and then I'm rocking a 61 overall in net, but we're just going to go with it. Top left. Go, oh, Solani. Look at this. Look at this. Look at this. Solani to Crosby back door. Nice and easy. And he's got no bucket power in there. That's a solid tendy as well, 85 overall. The skill stick on defense, which you don't see a lot. He's been just like holding the stick out there, poking around. Nice save, Johnson. There's his first save of the game. Let's go. Halsey's going back door again. Oh my! Why was Perrant not making those saves last game? What a save. Oh my, okay. 
Oh my goodness. Did you see that desperation effort from the bronze card? You don't see that from Perron. I'm just saying, this guy's got heart out here. Oh, yep, back door. Let's go. That patience from Zach Wierenski to find Gretzky back door. Oh my gosh, one more rush. Six seconds. LT, see you, bud. Back door. Come on, Ovi. Oh my gosh. Gretzky. Gretzky. One hander. Oh, I almost got up and celebrated there. I thought for sure that was going in. Alright, I gotta say, my dude, uh, my dude Tyler Johnson in net right now. Playing out of his Okay, Bauer. Okay, I swear Perron is not making those saves. The guy that scored like three, four shots in a row last game, they were all that shot right there. And they went in every single time. Bauer? Not so much. Hey, maybe Perron's just trash. Oh my gosh. Yo, Tyler Johnson, I gotta give credit where credit is due. Tyler Johnson made that initial save, and I think it like hit off a leg or hit off a skate and bounced into the corner. Nothing he could do on that one. All right, if the test was to end right now, I'm mostly just impressed with this dude, Bauer. Like, yeah, Tyler Johnson. Oh my. Oh my gosh. Tyler, you legend. Make another save. Dude, he, he's just as good as Perron. He really is. Oh my, another breakaway. Yo, what is that? Oh my, what a move. Oh, Taylor Hall. Bang. I'm buying a Bauer. I'm buying a Bauer right this instant. We're tossing him in the net after this game. Bauer's the card that you want to use. <laughs> this is unreal. Oh my, Bauer, you are a tank. Give me, give me another here. All right, I'll take another power play. Give me a top left snipe. Oh my, that's that's Paul Coffey. Boys, I think we're definitely finding some results here. Bauer's the best goalie in the game. That's all there is to it. This is unbelievable. So Tyler Johnson, you know, maybe Tyler Johnson's the number two goalie in the game. Bauer's got to be number one. Oh my, Tyler Johnson! Yo, I swear, goalies don't matter. There's just no way. He, there's no way a bronze goalie makes that save. Between that save right there, like a wide open rebound, and the one earlier where he like dove backwards with the desperation save, I think honestly, I'm convinced. I'm convinced goalies mean nothing. Top right. What just happened? I think it got blocked and then Solani bats it out of the air from like the face-off circle. That is one of the strangest, nicest baseball bats I have ever seen. It bounced off his chest, off the defender's chest. And Solani bats it into the back of the net. That's what a 90 overall does for you. What a goal. We still have one period to go, but so far, dude, Tyler Johnson, bronze 61 overall, is playing without a doubt better than my Perron did last game. All right, after last game, you know, I'm up 3-1 right now, but after last game, I need to get a couple more goals here to really secure this lead because anything is possible in the third, except with Tyler Johnson in net. It's just a for sure win. All right, boys, 640 left, and we're going on the power play. So I gotta make, I gotta make some big mistakes to lose this game. Can we get one more goal? Alexander Ovechkin with the snipe, and that will secure it. I mean, I know it's a small sample size, all right? We're only playing two games, one with a good goalie, one with a bad goalie. But so far, from what I have seen in this game especially, Tyler Johnson, 61 overall bronze, he played... It, I have to say it, he played better than Perron. There's just no doubt in my mind. I kind of I kind of want to give him like another shot or two. Here, we'll let we'll let him have the puck and just see what he does. Ready? Here. Take it to the house. <laughs> Big save. <laughs> one more. I'll give you one more. I'll give you one more. Here. I'm I'm pulling my players away. Oh my gosh. Here. Keep taking shots. Keep taking shots. I'm trying to let him shoot. Here we go. Another one. Oh my gosh, Tyler Johnson is insane, dude. I don't know, boy. Maybe we found something out today. 
maybe we finally found something out. Like, that's a lot of high quality shots there, especially towards the end. None of them find a way to go in with high quality players shooting at a low quality goalie. And then we just go down and bury one more for the heck of it. Why not? I gotta say, at first, I was rattled we lost the first game. Now I'm like, you know what? I, I might rock a bronze goal. I'm not even kidding when I'm saying this. I might rock a bronze goalie just to see what happens. I'm gonna test this out some more and I'll definitely let you guys know what I find. But from today's test alone, I enjoyed using the 61 overall Tyler Johnson more than the 87 overall Perron. That's just me though. Look at that save percentage though, 18 total shots. And like I said, not every single one of those was just like into the chest or a nice shot from the point. Like he had some good opportunities and some really good saves. So from my findings today, goalies don't mean all that much in hunt. Maybe they make a bit of a difference, but my dude Tyler Johnson, He's the legend. Another thing to keep in mind is the height of the goalies. A lot of people feel like Perrant is really, really bad because of his short height. He's only 5'10", and Tyler Johnson is sitting at 6'2". So maybe height is what makes the difference? I don't know. We're going to need to test that one out for another video. If you guys want to see some more tests like this, let me know in the comment section down below. I love testing this out, and I really do want to get to the bottom of this. What is going on? with goalies this year. For me right now, I like the 61 overall Tyler Johnson. Maybe we try out a silver goalie. Maybe we try out an 80 overall, 81, 84. See what the difference is between each of them in a future video. If you wanna see that, toss the video with a like. For real though, thank you guys so much for all the love and support you've been showing me on YouTube and Twitch recently. It has been an absolute blast and I really do enjoy waking up every day and making content for you guys. So we got much more on the way. Be sure to hit that subscribe button. We got my 24 hour stream on Friday. Don't forget it. Twitch.tv slash Nasher. Hit me with a follow on there. And I'll see you guys on Friday. Talk to you then. Peace.